What's up? My name is Technoba here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be showing you how to fix this DLL error that you could be getting when you're trying to fire up Crisis 2 Remastered. Don't worry, I'm on Windows 11, but this video applies for Windows 10 as well. If you see this error, don't worry, nothing bad is happening. All that's gone wrong is that your computer is missing a specific DLL file or it's become corrupt or unreachable for some other reason. These files are needed as they contain bits of code that programs use. Without them, they can't function properly. And these DLL files are distributed by Microsoft themselves through official installers. So if you've come across a video telling you to download DLLs, you definitely shouldn't follow them. You should always get the official installer from the official source to get the DLLs in them. Anyways, with that warning out of the way, let's go ahead and download the installer to fix this error. I'll open up the link in a browser. You'll find it in the description down below. You should see a page that looks something like this. Simply scroll down and click the orange download button. Then a file will be downloaded onto your computer. This is the DirectX end user runtime installer. Click on it to open it up and then click yes when prompted for admin. In this new window that's popped up, click I accept. Next, uncheck the Bing bar. Next, and then click next once again. The next two steps involve automatically downloading all different versions of DirectX and then automatically installing different versions of DirectX. Downloading files, of course, depends on your internet speed. Then the second step, installing components, depends on the speed of your computer, hard drives, etc. Then it's done. All you need to do is click finish. At this point, you should be able to fire up games and programs that you were having issues with previously, but if you're still getting errors and issues, make sure to restart your computer and then try the games and programs once more. But anyways, that's about it for this video. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Technobay of a Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.